Are you looking for the best video conferencing equipment for your remote office? If so, you're in the right place. Today we will be discussing the best video conferencing equipment for you to use while working from home. I'm Raid here with JotForm. Let's jump right into it. First, let's talk about video chat software. The most popular video chat software on the market right now is Zoom. Zoom allows you to host online meetings, training, as well as video webinars. The software is consistent and reliable. It is used by large companies like Box, NASDAQ, Uber, Delta, and Slack. Zoom can be useful for customers in a variety of industries, including education, finance, government, and healthcare. They offer plans starting at $14.99 per month per host for small teams. They even have a free option for attending personal meetings. Zoom also has a training resource page, which is dedicated to helping people transition from in-person to remote work. Another great video chat app is Skype. You can have a group video call with up to 50 people, which allows you to meet and collaborate remotely with coworkers. And if you need to present PowerPoint slides or video recordings to your team, you can use Skype's group screen sharing feature. It also comes with additional features like full screen video, chat invites, and background blur. Group video calls with up to 50 people are completely free on any device, tablet, or computer. It can also be used to call phones free of charge. Up next is Microsoft Teams. This meeting software combines instant messaging, video conferencing, calling, and document collaboration with one integrated solution. Microsoft Teams allows you to meet with just a few people or up to 250 people, depending on your needs. Teams is included with Office 365 and starts at just $5 per user per month with the Business Basic plan. This plan comes with other Microsoft apps like Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. It even comes with services like Exchange, OneDrive, and SharePoint. If you decide to go with a higher tier plan, you'll also have Outlook, Publisher, and Access at your disposal. Up next is GoToMeeting. This software is specifically made to be an HD video conferencing solution. They allow you to host personalized online meetings with face-to-face -face video conferencing. You will get features like screen sharing, conference calling, video conferencing, mobile conferencing, meeting recording, and transcription, as well as conference room equipment. With GoToMeeting, you will also get benefits like high quality video, single tap meetings, and integrated scheduling. Their plans start at $12 per organizer per month and allows for up to 150 participants. With so many features, you will get a big bang for your buck. Okay, we've talked about video conferencing software, now let's get into hardware. If you're doing a lot of video conferencing, you're going to want a high quality webcam. The Logitech C920S HD webcam is a good choice to add to any computer setup for working from home. This webcam comes with an HD autofocus and light correction, which makes for a clear picture. And the stereo audio with dual mics allows for a more natural sound. It also comes with a lens cover for privacy outside of your conference calls. This Logitech model is priced at around $70 on most websites, which is a great value for the features that you're getting. Up next is another webcam from Logitech, the Logitech HD Webcam C615. This is a more basic option compared to our first webcam, but it still has high definition video calling and still image capture. It even comes with one-click upload capabilities, which allows you to share videos and photos. Their features also include still image resolution of up to eight megapixels, a CMOS image sensor, a built-in microphone, and fold and go design. This is also a great starter webcam with a price in the $40 to $50 range. Next, we have the Razer Keo webcam. This webcam is perfect for gamers, content creators, and broadcasters. And you can easily integrate it with streaming platforms for a smooth setup. It even comes with a built-in ring light with adjustable brightness for a studio-like setting. This webcam also comes with a four megapixel sensor with right light technology, neutral color representation, a USB 2.0 interface, and has a compact portable design. This webcam costs about $100 and it's a good option for someone who needs their webcam for more than just video conferences. Now, let's look at some general hardware that's good to have for video conferencing. 
Let's start off with the Jabra Speak 510 wireless Bluetooth speaker. This speaker lets you hold meetings with up to four people and with a battery life of up to 15 hours. It can last you all day long. It also comes with a Bluetooth cable, a USB cable, and a noise canceling microphone. This speaker can work with multiple devices. It is easy to set up. It has a slim design. This speaker will cost you about $150. This is a good, affordable option if the speakers on your phone or computer are not doing the trick. Up next is the Google Jamboard. This is the perfect smart board for creative team collaboration. This interactive whiteboard allows you to draw images, add notes, and pull assets from the web while collaborating with your team members anywhere. And since this is the Google Jamboard, you can integrate other Google apps like Docs, Sheets, and Slides. While this board is a great option for improving the remote work environment, it is more expensive starting at $4,999. This price includes one Jamboard display, two styluses, one racer, and one wall mount. And the annual management and support fee is an extra $600. Next, we have the Zoom LiveTrack L8 Podcast Digital Mixer and Recorder. If you have multiple people speaking at once, this tool allows you to adjust each microphone's level to keep the volume consistent on each speaker. Doing this is simple as long as each mic is connected to a mixer, which assigns different tracks to each microphone. This can be especially helpful when you are recording multiple people for one presentation. This tool is used mainly for podcasting and can record presentation in the workplace as well. It comes with an eight channel mixer, multi-track recording, a TRRS connection, a mix minus function, and has a portable design. This model runs about $400, which is a mid-range price for most audio mixers used for presentations and podcasts. Now, let's take a look at audio gear. First, we have the Blue Yeti USB microphone. This is a popular choice for podcast recording and live streaming. It also works well for anyone holding video conferences or team calls. The Blue Yeti comes with several features, including a tri-capsule array, a mute option, a USB plug, and zero latency headphone output. It also comes with four pickup patterns, including cardioid, bidirectional, omnidirectional, and stereo. This microphone goes for about $130, and it can be purchased with multiple accessories, including boom arms and shock mounts. Next, we have the ATR2100 USB mic. This is a handheld microphone with a USB digital output and an XLR analog output. It comes with a built-in headphone jack, extended frequency response, and excess noise reduction. You can also purchase XLR cables, a tripod desk stand, or a stand clamp along with the mic. Coming in at about $80, this microphone is the most affordable option, but any added accessories will drive up the initial cost. And finally, we have the ATR2500 USB mic. This microphone is a step up from the ATR2100. This is a cardioid condenser mic, making it ideal for digital recording. It also comes with features like high quality AD converter, excellent frequency response, as well as built-in controls and monitoring. You can also use this microphone with a conventional stand or on a tabletop. It is slightly more expensive than the previous microphone as it costs about $110. This price includes the USB cable, a tripod desk stand, and a pivoting threaded standard mount. Okay, let's review the tools we talked about today. In the video chat software, we discussed Zoom, Skype, Microsoft Teams, and GoToMeeting. For webcams, we talked about the Razer Keo, Logitech C920S, and the Logitech HD C615. As for general hardware, there's the Jabra Speak 510 Bluetooth speaker, the Google Jamboard, and the Zoom LiveTrack L8 digital mixer and recorder. And finally, for audio gear, we discussed the Blue Yeti, ATR2100, and ATR2500 USB microphones. These pieces of equipment will help make video conferencing from home a breeze. Thanks for watching today. I'm Raid here with Jotform. Have a great day. <laughs>